Oh, hey everyone, how's it going? Hey, listen, hope you're having a fantastic Monday so far. And listen, remember, every single week is a brand new opportunity to start new and get a little bit better. And today I just want to talk to you guys real quickly about something that I think is super, super important, gratitude. Now, I personally think that this could be considered one of the secrets to life and happiness, so to speak. Um, you know, I could go into the psychology and science and all that type of stuff, but I'm just going to keep it simple and short and sweet today. So if we really think about it, you know, um, thoughts are things. Thoughts are things. And what I mean by that, what you focus on grows. So, for example, um, if you're always thinking negative or things that are going wrong in your life and you're focused on that and what's not good, then you're really going to attract more of that stuff into your life. And I think if we're honest with ourselves, we can see a pattern if that's, you know, if that's what's happening in our life. Conversely, if we're happy and, you know, go lucky and focusing on all the things that are great and that we're grateful for, we tend to continue that mood until, you know, an outside force comes in and acts upon us and maybe changes that. So I just want to encourage you guys, just with that perspective in mind, that gratitude is really the attitude. And, you know, maybe you wake up in the morning and the first thing you do is talk to yourself or write it down about all the things you're grateful for. And before you go to bed at night, maybe you have a journal or um, you record your voice saying it or something. Um, maybe just as an example, it could be simple things like I'm grateful for a bed to sleep in at night, a roof over my head, um, meals every day, a family that loves me, friends that care about me, transportation, you have a car. Whatever it is, it could be big things, small things, it doesn't really matter. I just want to encourage you guys um, to try our best to focus on what we're grateful for. And I think things will be a lot better that way. You know, it's easy to get distracted by all the noise out there, especially this year with all the craziness going on, politics, the economy, and what have you. Um, but I just want to challenge you guys to focus on gratitude. Like I said, thoughts are things. What we think about, we bring about. What we think about constantly and most often usually manifests into our life in some portion because that's what we're focused on. And so we naturally gravitate and make decisions that um, bring about the things we're focused on. And uh, I want to leave it on something I found on Twitter. Um, the post is from someone named Maggie Smith. Their at is um, at Maggie Smith Poet. And here's what she says. Let go of the idea that things could have happened differently as if this life is a choose your own adventure book and you simply just turned the wrong page. You did the best you could with what you knew and felt at the time. Now do better, knowing more, keep moving. So I think if we can really focus on the things that have made us who we are, maybe some bad things have happened. But I think if we're thankful for those things instead of regretting them, like she's kind of talking about there with choose your own adventure, worried about the wrong page being turned, Conversely, being grateful for those pages and using them as motivation and a tool to move forward. Um, I hope that was helpful for you guys in some shape or form. Um, this is something that I'm starting to practice a lot more in my life, and I hope and encourage you guys to do the same.